Welcome back. Chris Sawyer here with Kevin Catfish at the NCPA Championships here in Lakeland, Florida. Whoa, Ooh, that was a couple. I almost those just got murdered that was right a couple, now, bro. <laughs> couple you heaters, see that? Up, couple heaters yeah. up here. <laughs> couple, got murdered. Couple heaters up here in the booth. You know, you seen there? You know, you seen up. Uh, we're up here in the middle of nowhere. We had a couple heaters come over, come over the we're top, the top over and here. about smoke okay, Kevin. Yeah, I, I got uh, glasses on at least, Chris. I'm, you, <laughs> I'm Chris Lasoya. I'm here with Kevin Catfish, Maddie Marshall, and uh, Todd Martinez taking a break. We also have our sidekick. Laura McKeeman down there in the field as well, giving us the sideline stuff and the little tidbits here and Super there. Super spy. Hope you guys have a good time at home watching the webcast. It's a nice day out here, nice and overcast, not real hot, not real cold. Um, you know, we got Tennessee coming up against Liberty. Liberty undefeated during the season, um, coming off hot and cold. I, was, I watched Tennessee earlier play. I was really impressressed by the way they were playing. Um, they, they won 6-4, 4-2, and attended 2 um, with an average margin of four points. Five um, seconds on the clock here. You know, let's get this game started. You see on your screen right there, that's Tennessee. I want to see what comes out of Liberty. Either going to come out hard or they're going to come out slow. Great push on the break right, right there by Tennessee. For Tennessee. Right up the gut. I like, see, that was the same play that, that uh, Cal State like Long Jason Beach used. Rudy. Yep, but the losing, losing the player in the process. You know, Tennessee working it out. You know, uh, I, as well as uh, Liberty losing losing one of their, their snake players here. You know, look look at Tennessee getting up in the mix, getting in the snake. Um, all of, oh geez, getting blown to pieces. <laughs> Actually, you know, I've been I've been seeing that a lot. Um, you know, Tennessee taking a few bounces. They played really strong earlier, Kevin, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what they do. I'm a I'm a Liberty fan. I'm not gonna lie. I like the team. You know, I got Tosh Point oh, on my boy out there. Two Tennessee players coming up, as well as two Liberty yep. players coming up. And look at this move right here by Tennessee. Smart heads up paintball. Hey man, I lost my guy in the snake. That's Colby Jarrett. Not real surprised here yeah, because exactly. he's, he's, he's been a, stunning. He's a smart dude. I'd expect that out of him. Now look, he's gonna go all the way to the yeah. 50, past the 50. Oh no, there he goes. Liberty but, but, uh, losing players here. But look at him. I'm telling you, Colby Jarrett going to work. Yeah, I was impressed with him last game. Um, but I'm, you know, like I said, oh, and another player coming out oh, top right start of your screen. Jarrett just getting clipped on the top of his dome right there. You know, but now it's two on one, and, that, and that's not that's Davidson out there. That's Kevin, I believe. Um, uh, Brian Davidson. I was calling him Kevin. I was calling him Kevin. Actually, he got shot. I called him Kevin all last year for like the first <laughs> half of the tournament. That's a good name. That's a good name. It is. Um, but Brian Davidson, no slouch on the paintball field. Um, I don't know where his visor is, though. I mean, yeah. I don't recognize him without a visor. <laughs> Put the know, visor on, with, kid. With the Billy Wing visor. Um, you know, right there, uh, Tennessee taking it to him. They came out aggressive, came out hard. Kobe Jarrett making a good uh, a good fill out in the snake, realizing his snake guy is gone. But only get out there getting shot. So yeah, Definitely. Nick uh, making that move for Liberty and just couldn't get out to the snake, getting shot in transition, trying to get into the snake. Yeah, Jackson Rudy hanging the flag. Another name player that I know from last year. Like I said, yeah, I went down there. I interviewed these guys in the field last year after the tournament, and man, just a great bunch of guys. Oh, yeah, um, definitely. Liberty University, huge Catholic. I think Christian school. Um, you know, so I, I just and like the support they get from the school is incredible. It's phenomenal. Friend. You know, so I mean, for all you people at home, so you don't, so you know, you know, all these college, you know, they they have different budgets for different schools. Obviously, some yeah. are more than others. You know, a lot of these players take a lot of their own time and money out and get on the field. But the support from the colleges is what makes the difference. We also had a high school tournament. High school is out here. Yeah. You know, that makes all the difference in the world. I've, I've talked to a few families, you know, parents, moms, dads. And uh, to be honest with you, the, the response we got out here, you can see out in the crowd, families, daughters, sisters. Thank God for bringing your sisters. Um, you know, we have a huge, see, that's what I'm talking about. That is what paintball is all about right there. Beer, Doritos, and lemon. So, you know, you got FAU, they, they're out of Florida Atlantic, they're, they're a local team, they have a lot of fun. There's a lot of families out here, and I like seeing that, you know, the support from all the families. Yeah. They're having a good time. Chris Rail and crew out here run a great, a great tournament. You got, you got God and, and the boys down in the... Uh, oh, I'm in, taking heaters again, <laughs> take, Chris. Taking heaters, taking heaters. I think that's where they came yeah. from last time. Where did they come from? I'm telling you. See? God. We see, we see you. God, help <laughs> they're, me. It's, uh, they're coming from their... They're coming from I feel their, you, brother. <laughs> hey, you're out there getting shot. We're up here chilling, baby. So, Tennessee up 1-0 on Liberty. I can see Liberty. Out. They came out strong, though. They, did, they weren't slouches. Um, I think this, this is, like I said, this is a finals game right here as far as I'm concerned. Definitely a finals. This is a you know, clash of the titans right now. I'm, I'm telling you. See, look at everybody in the shade over there. They're all just chilling out. Um, you got HK over there. Thanks for, you know, they're out here. They have a booth out here. You have the big evil truck. You got Raza um, out there as well with their yeah, booth. Raza, Raza and everybody. Look at this breakout now. Look at Davidson. Nick trying to get into the snake. Doing you know, a, he looks a little gimpy, man. I yeah, mean, he does. That arm might yeah, be injuring him. I, I hope not, man. He's one of their star, you know, snake players, and uh, I'd like to see him go into work. Five on five right now. Nobody, 
Everybody makes it to the bunker on, on the break. No problems. You know, there's Davidson, Brian getting up in the mix. On your screen right now, only one player in the yellow zone for Tennessee. Um, here he comes the snake. That's a good move. Is that Kobe Jarrett? Yes, sure it is. is. Yep. Yep. Kobe Jarrett going to work. Also making moves up in the yellow zone, filling out. See, look at these crisp fill look moves. Look for Nick. Here comes Tozzi. Here, here comes Tozzi. Oh, he's coming to them bumping. Oh, oh. Tozzi. Come on. Point oh, Get in the game. And he, you know what? He's, oh, oh look goodness. at Kobe Jarrett. Jarrett is just feasting. feasting. There's four guys alive. Oh, I want your soul. Oh, give me, give me your face. Give me your face. Give me meat. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's like, he's like a carnivore at a, at a meat shop. <laughs> I'm going to eat your liver. <laughs> he doesn't want to eat my liver. Yeah. <laughs> Not for this weekend. Yeah, he get poisoned, he, he, get, he get drunk. <laughs> oh. Uh, uh. Yeah. <laughs> go, go. Oh, oh in, that was in a the shot. face. Yes, He's feasting right now. Thanks for showing me your pack. Kobe Jarrett just is yeah. And in you know beast what? mode right I'll now. That right guy's now. in beast mode right now. I'm telling you. And, and let's just let's go back to when our our sidekick Laura McKeon down downstairs interviewed him earlier. Did he? That was Kobe, right? Yeah. He interviewed. Him? Yeah. You would you would never guess that is under that mask. Yeah, not at all. The kid looks like like a, an accountant or something. <laughs> you know what? Speaking of my favorite lady in the world, uh, besides my girl, obviously. Let me put that out. Let me put that out there. Let's go down to Laura. See what she has to say. I'm glad you're trying to avoid some trouble there, Chris. But uh, before this game, I talked to our man Nick Tossi, and he said, "Hey, we understand the advantage that we have in the sense that we did not have to play before now today." But he said he's not sure if it's an advantage in some ways because you're able to get a little warmed up like Tennessee. They've already played today. They're in a groove. They're not having those early match jitters that sometimes happen. So I don't know. What do you guys think about that, Chris? Is it better to have played before or better to have conserved your energy? You know, that's a very good point right there. I mean, playing before to warm up, Laura, is, is kind of key. Um, yeah. You know, you get a lot of chances to sit around and watch games, yes, but you get cold. Yeah, I'd, rather, I'd rather just play and play and play because you, you're warmed up. You know, playing against a team that had played earlier, um, you know, they're already warm. They've been out. They know the equipment works. There's so many variables that come definitely. into playing. I mean, you're, you know, you can go out there on a game and, you know, your gun doesn't work. Yeah, definitely. It's like any professional sport, man. In basketball, you have to shoot around before the game. In uh, baseball, you get batting practice. You know? Right. Yeah, absolutely. So it's like, you know, it's treated like any professional sport. Well, it's 2-0 to zero right now in favor of Tennessee, and they're looking really strong right now. And like, uh, you know, Kobe had said before, uh, Kobe Jarrett from Tennessee, he had said, you know, these guys beat our butt most of the year. Um, you know, we're, ex we're expecting the best, but we know we, we know exactly what they're going to do and how they're going to do it. Let's, just, let's go out there and play our game and see who comes out on top. And right now, <laughs> Tennessee is just taking it to my boys at Liberty. Um, I th I'm sure that, uh, that Tossie's mom is at home. I want to give a shout-out to her. I'm sure she's listening so she, I can make fun of her son all day. Um, hope everybody at home is having a good time. And, you know, Tennessee right now is looking stronger than Liberty. Yeah, I mean, they're hitting all their spots. They're hitting all their lanes, you know. And Jared's in beast mode. Oh right now. man, he and is like in I beast said, mode right if now. If I was to see that kid in the street, I would never, I would never <laughs> guess. Like he's he's very aggressive. Like be aggressive, aggressive. Be, be, be aggressive. aggressive. Like the kid is just out of control. Um, you know, he's he's actually he's uh, obviously on a superstar team like he's got. I mean, but it, his it's a it's a deep roster. Brian Arakawa, uh, Joe Jenkins, uh, Jackson Rudy. I mean, I, I can so go on this list. Yeah, they're so deep, so I can't single out one player. But hey, man, if you're shooting everybody, or most everybody, I'm going to talk about you. Yeah. You know, so tip to all you guys down there when you want to get talked about, <laughs> either, do, either do something really yeah. dumb, <laughs> which which happens, yeah. or shoot people. Yeah. So I prefer shoot people. <laughs> I don't. I, 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 like, it, I like the latter. <laughs> Here, strong breakout by Tennessee. I see him going up the middle. Ooh, that's not really a strong breakout. Oh, no. look at what happened to that guy. I don't know. <laughs> Jeez, that's a big dirt hole there, yeah, the right there. Hole. This guy, and this guy's been impressing oh, me too in the man. snake. This guy's been impressing me right there for oh, losing three players, four three. players. Oh, uh, uh, see, it's a one on five. Just going to work, and that that right there is I think Aaron Thompson for Liberty. Yeah, um, he actually impressed me uh, as a as a snake player uh, the other day too. Yeah. So, and he's quick, man. He is quick. He has he has happy feet on him. He has happy you. feet. <laughs> you know, and hey, look at that. See, now that is the liberty that should be yeah, playing. Right there. Yeah. God, why does everybody run like a nerd around here? <laughs> what is up? Nerd mode. He even, he, <laughs> man. I, I, okay. You know what? I'm not going to say it. 
<laughs> Go ahead, no, no, Chris, no, no, say something, no, Chris. I'm, no, something, I would like to hear it. Something, Chris. So would everyone at home. <laughs> right there, Thompson, Aaron Thompson going to work. Now he is, uh, you know, it looked to me like Bob, like Tosh.0 is having some trouble. Yeah. Um, you know, he looked a little uncomfortable. Um, I think he's a little unsure putting that arm down. And I can relate to that because yeah. when I had my knee injury, man, it took me a good two years to actually get to feel comfortable again running and stopping on that knee. Definitely. And so, putting that pressure on there. You yeah. Know, isn't helping. Oh, no, because it scares you a little bit. And, yeah. you know, you don't want to hurt again. So he going into the snake, he looked a little uncomfortable. Yeah, a little out of place, you know? Yeah. Well, not, not, to be dis not, not to be dislocated or anything. <laughs> yeah, I see what you did there. Right again. there, I, I see Brian Arakawa walking on the field for Tennessee Volunteers. That's number 12. You know, right there on your screen, that's uh, Tosh.0, 5-4-0. Uh, right there is Brian Arakawa. He impressed me a little bit. You got Rudy out there and also Jared. Uh, Jared, Kobe Jarrett. You know, strong, strong, strong line out there right now for yeah. Tennessee. You no know, but slouches out there right now. Th th all these kids, if they can't run, you know, I see, a, let's say, uh, game runs. What? 12 points, let's say yeah. max 12, 14 points. If these kids can't play 14 straight points, they, <laughs> seriously, I can, I, well, I'm not going to say I can, but, <laughs> but I'm telling you, I mean, but these kids are out here going to work. Yeah. They're running down the field. Um, Youth. Yeah, look at them. I mean, he, he <laughs> I had a hundred things to say, but I think I don't want to buy a six pack. <laughs> so, I would you like know, a six pack, Chris. I'm, I'm sure you would. <laughs> so would I. Stop eating those donuts and you might get <laughs> one. Oh, I'm here all week. I like my shape. <laughs> <Ram>. <laughs> Round like a donut. Round like a donut. And here we go. That's the Tennessee Volunteers on your screen right now. Um, just for those guys at home, you know, we get, let's get a field shot. We can look at the field. The field split up into three separate spots. You have blue, which is the back side. You have the yellow zone and the red zone. Red zone is where you want to be. That is where you're going to get Kill the kills. Zone. Get up in the red zone. Let's go, Liberty. I want to see what happens let's with go, these guys see now. What gonna there do comes here. Tom, there comes David Tom, uh, Brian Thompson. Oh, see, go, Brian Davidson. I'll, I'll get it right sooner or later. Uh, you know what? That's what I'm talking about. Now he's in position. If they try to come out to this side yeah. at all, Kevin, they are done. Yeah. As long as he stays alive. But I just jinxed oh, him. That's the key, staying alive. <laughs> Don't you know, jinx him. Right Chris. there, see? And Jared into that, the snake. That's what I like. Look at, look at, look at Davidson. What are you doing, you nerd? <laughs> Seriously. If he shoots him in the pack, he's not going to be that much of a nerd. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm just you? telling you. This. Brian oh, Davidson. Davidson. Brian Davidson. I, I, I don't know what to say to that. But you know what? He's, in a, he's still in a good spot, though. I mean, he's going to contain Kobe Jarrett uh, um, right there. Tennessee, Tennessee losing a, losing Benjamin DeVault right there. Now, uh, going hard. Oh, see? And right losing their far player, top side of your screen. Losing their Dorito player, trying to make it in the yellow zone for Liberty. But there's Davidson. He, I've seen this guy pull out many games. I haven't seen a lot from him this weekend, to be honest with you. Um, but he's a solid, solid player. Yeah, yeah Jarrett looking for that. That eliminate that key elimination to loosen him up in the snake right here. And also you got you got um Aaron Thompson, Thompson. chilling out in the back. Yeah. I don't see him. He's stuck. He's not that's it. not that he wants to be back there. He just has nowhere to go right exactly. now. And right now two guns Kobe, on him. Kobe Jarrett has him on lockdown. That's what yeah. Kobe's doing right there. He's, 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 down. He's, he's locking down Aaron Thompson from getting outside. Um, you know, all still they got two players back in the blue zone. It's four on four right now. Um but it's, 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 like it's a stalemate game. It's 349. Game. But you know what? Liberty needs to win this point. You want to keep it close. Oh, Liberty making moves on the Dorito side. Oh, Jerry trying to get and, frisky over a, here. And great move. If you look at the left side of your screen, behind Kobe Jarrett, um, he got a good fill by number 16, Jason or Jackson Rudy, um, making a good move because he needs support back there, Kevin. Definitely needs support. Look for Jared to make some sort of move here, kind of loosen himself up. And yeah, I, Davidson looks like he's a set to put the hurt on him if he tries to do anything. Well, I think if if for some reason Jared goes to the 50, I can see uh, Brian coming in and you know taking him out. Yeah. I mean, because he, he I think he wants to get him in because uh, honestly Brian's going to die there anyway, so you yeah. might as well come get him. So, the only know, thing keeping him is that back player that fills in. Yep. Uh, and you know, I, I see Davidson putting him yeah. in right away because you can block him. You can block him out with the pins. So, this is true. True you know, story I heard on the internet. Right. <laughs> right there, you see two players for Liberty in the yellow zone, top of your screen in the Doritos, and down in the bottom of your screen, Brian Davidson, and then Kobe Jarrett. Right there, you see the lane. He's actually keeping the top right of your screen, that blue bunker. That is where Aaron Thompson is. Yeah. So keeping he's, him at he's, bay. He's keeping him at bay. Oh, now, uh, oh, I can see Kobe Jarrett getting. Oh, oh there goes Davison Brian Davidson. Gets smoked. Getting smoked by by number 16, Jackson Rudy, like we talked oh, about. Oh, yeah, Jarrett into Support. the red. The kill zone now, as yeah. you would. Oh, Eric, not Aaron, not a good 
Yeah, Aaron's, spot in, for him. Aaron's in a bad spot. Yes, he is. He needs um, to make something happen. You see Kobe Jarrett, you know, he's sitting on the right side of that, uh, the right side of that bunker just controlling Aaron. Oh, um, oh he gets, Jerry gets, gets clipped. clipped. That was a great shot by Aaron Thompson. That was. He worked him. Yeah, you know what? And that just shows the level of play. Yeah. Kobe Jarrett will do it to you, and Aaron yeah. Thompson will do it right he back just to the very next game. Him. That's, you know, textbook wrapping right there. Yep, I think it's a two-on-two. Two on two. Two. Uh, up at the fit, up in the red zone, top side of your screen, you have Liberty in the 50 Dorito. So right now, Tennessee on their heels. They have both corners. All they got to do pretty much is cross up. One minute, 40 seconds I might, left. I might, there might be three Aaron, Liberty players. Aaron Thompson, Aaron Thompson. I think there is three actually. Aaron, there is, yeah. Aaron Thompson needs to get in this snake. If you look in the right hand side of your screen in one second, and look for Aaron you. Thompson. There he, he goes, getting in the snake. Now get down the snake. Don't yeah. be a sissy. Nobody's even looking at you. That's that's coach. Coach needs to let him know. Yeah, you know what he he I mean he can, he can see the corner guy there, Kevin. But honestly, get up the field. Yeah. Get up the field Wasting so that your time there. There's no shot there. Yeah, get up the field so they can they can yeah, see I like this move. Yeah. Stepping out to the little cowboy step out there. <laughs> little hot line, stepper. line stepping out. <laughs> Boots and buckles, baby. Boots and buckles. Boots and buckles. Oh, look at this. High stepping over here yeah, on this hot, side. He's a hot stepper. He, <laughs> he must have ran track and did the what do you call those things? The hud huddles? No, no the, the hurdles. The hurdles. <laughs> No, but that right there, Aaron Thompson finally getting out to the snake thanks to Kobe Jarrett getting shot in the face. In the face. In the face. Now, get, see, he's got to get up the field, though. Yeah, uh, the guy, is, has to. he needs to recognize that the back He needs back to go right, down the highway back ex into the snake. Yeah, exactly. He, I mean, you can get a shot across the field. Yeah. You know, but here's the problem is what's going to happen is he's going to get up there, and then they're going to say switch, and the guy in the corner over here, yeah. which is Jackson Rudy, is going to blow him to pieces. But there's 27 seconds left. Get up the field. There's Jackson Rudy just locking down that Dorito oh. side. Here it comes. Like, this is what I like to see. That's number 110 right there, Cody Leeworthy. Is he worthy? They're not, but you know what? They're going to run out of time. Oh, uh, Leeworthy getting shot. No, that's not like, Leeworthy. I'm sorry, that was a 50 Dorito, dude. Yeah. Let's, Thompson. Oh, Thompson sees all it. alone. Thompson all alone. That's going to that's gonna do it. No, time's going to run out. Waste your time right there. You did. You know, but hey. Great game. You know what? Honestly, they gave it a good shot. Good job by Tennessee. Number 12 right there, holding things down. That's Brian Ar Arakawa. Like we talked about, he's a solid player. He was over there in the blue zone, chilling out in the holding corner. Holding it down. Holding it down with Jackson Rudy. And that's, um, that's the thing, like these two uh, titans of teams, you, you, you can't just run down the field on them. Absolutely you know? not. And by you know, any means. No, not at all. But I mean, I'm telling you, those guys are fantastic paintball players. We're at the half right now. It is two to one in favor of Tennessee Volunteers. Um, you know, I, I, I like what I'm seeing, though. I, I, I think that it's like going gonna, gonna, gonna to be a good. I like what I'm seeing. Look at that there guy. You go. Hey, yo. <laughs> Clean me up. How you doing? <laughs> <laughs> right there on your screen is the Tennessee Volunteers. Um, you know, great, great paintball team. Uh, I, think, I, I think I see my girl chilling out in the field with one of my boys. Who was supposed to get us lunch, by the way? Yeah, did, did we get lunch, Chris? Uh, we didn't get lunch. So uh, are we ready? Uh, I think we're ready to go down and talk to her. Um, I think she's down there with Todd Martinez. Todd doing, Cash doing something. I mean, I, Todd was supposed to get us lunch, and yeah. I haven't seen nothing. I, yeah, I haven't seen anything either. Well, it looks like he ate it. He looks like oh, he ate, he ate it. our lunch. Little jerk. <laughs> Nerd. Way to go. Nerd. Let's look, see look him look run. Him. Make look him run, Chris. Make him run. Make him run. <laughs> Make him run. <laughs> Give me the nerd run. Dude, look at him. He looks like a looks like he's selling carton of cigarettes or he's selling cereal Are or something. Are those Girl Scout cookies? <laughs> uh, anyway, Catfish up here with me, Chris LaSoya, Maddie Marshall, and Tom Martinez running here somewhere. And then our sidekick, Laura McKeeman, one of my favorites, as always. She even stands cute. Like, look at the stance. Uh, uh, uh. Get it, get it, get it. Get it, get it, get it. You guys can't see. <laughs> <laughs> See? <laughs> That's what Todd was doing. I know he was. So, you know, like I said, great field today. As you see, like I said, the refs cleaning the bunkers off. We have the blue zone, the red zone, and the yellow zone. The red zone is where you want to be. Get up in the game. Stop being a sissy. Play paintball. Sissy la -la. You want to hurt people. That is what that, that God made paintball so you can get rid of your frustration and hurt exactly. people. Exactly. That is why you're here. Well, the frustration part. The frustration. I'm so frustrated. I need to hurt somebody. So two to one right now. Half the half right now for Liberty. Down by one point over Tennessee. Let's keep it close. I'm looking forward to seeing what happens in the second half. You know, I don't know, Kevin. What, what do you think is going to happen to the outcome of this game? Well, I think that Liberty needs to be aggressive. I mean, <laughs> be, be aggressive. I mean, they're being, right now, Tennessee's beating them to the punch. First is snakes, first is Doritos, you know, just eating up real, real estate, you know. That's what Liberty needs. They need a, you know. 
Yeah, they need to get on their horse and do something. Listen, we're going to take a break. Second half coming at you right now. I'm Chris Lasoy up here with Kevin Catfish. I'll be seeing you cats in a few minutes. We're going to talk about some really cool new products. Let's start with Super Freak. This thing is more accurate, very versatile. Oh. Wait, I could have gone with that. Yeah. I, the box. I thought that was kind of cool. Yeah. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We got to get the, the box back in. I'm trying to do a cool move. I just want to show the box. The yeah, the box is cool. You ready? Here with Todd Martinez from Infamous, ready to show off some cool new products. We got the Super Freak right here. Improved accuracy and also very versatile. Tell us what this does. Yes, what we have right here is the all new Super Freak from Empire Paintball. It comes in this cool, snazzy, 70s looking case. And this is, against again, the most versatile barrel that you're going to be able to find on the market today. It's got an original Freak back and it comes with five different inserts from 675. Uh, to 695. It also comes with three different tips for you to enjoy. You got your standard 14 inch aluminum tip. You have a carbon fiber tip. Or you have Empire's uh, patented Apex barrel that allows you to put a little different spin on the ball for people that like to play in the woods or like to, you know, nice. hit those curve shots on people. So it's the most versatile barrel you can get. Comes with the full complete package. All these inserts or all these tips um, work with all the original freak backs. And um, you have all these, all the freak inserts will work standard with this barrel as well. Okay, well, I'm going to put this on. This is supposed to be the most comfortable and the best of both worlds, correct? This mask, it feels great. Yes, this is another awesome new product that we have from Empire. It's called the E-Flex. Not only do you look awesome in it, but it's also got Empire's patented quick change lens that comes with the clear anti-fog um, protection layer. And it's mixed with the old style JT uh, ProFlex mask. So it's now got the, the breathable, flexible bottom skirt um, that you, is signature to JT's ProFlex mask. It's got beads on the back of the uh, goggle strap to make sure that it stays firmly against your blonde hair. And it also has um, some uh, really nice uh, foam, you know, a little bit thicker and uh, some thicker, nicer ear pads um, to, you know, for all the teams to be using and all the people to come out and get very soon. So, two new great products. I got them first. I'm glad, uh, glad I could share them with you and uh, check them out. They'll be available from Empire Paintball, your local dealer, very soon. All right. Well, this thing is incredibly comfortable. I'm going to wear this for the rest of the time if somebody will let me. Let's go back up to you guys. <laughs>
What's up, Princess Soy up here with Kevin Catfish up here at the NCAA Championships. Tennessee taking on Liberty right now, two to one in favor of Tennessee. You know, uh, this game's a really good game so far. I mean, yeah. it's not a huge blowout. Score's nice and close. Both teams seem evenly matched up. I said this is like almost a, almost the finals game. What do you think, Def Kevin? It's definitely a finals game in, in my book, you know. I mean, like you said, no one's jumping out with a big lead. Both teams are just fighting for every little inch that they can take. You know? Th that's right. Liberty undefeated in the regular season and also last year's champions. Tennessee coming out of the box really strong. I like, I, I like what I'm seeing on both these Definitely. teams. But now let's see now that you're coming down, now you're coming down the field. Left-hand dominant for Kobe Jarrett. Let's see how he does. Breakout right there by Tennessee. Nice kind of control breakout. Nothing crazy. Both teams five on five right now. Nobody getting shot in the break. Um, kind of conservative little breakout by both teams. You got Brian Davidson right there. Um, enjoys fishing. Uh, you know, coming up, see, that was, a, that, I like that move by Brian, yeah, kicking out, uh, you know, he's got a good guy in the corner right next to him. Tennessee lo losing two players coming off the back right now. You know, I, I, I haven't seen a lot of point oh. I haven't seen point oh here in a minute, but like you said, coming out in drones, yeah. you, lo you lose two players against a team like this. You know, You're Tennessee, Tennessee on their heels right now. They got two in the blue zone, and um, right there, you know, you see Liberty, you see, yes, look for him to make a quick move. You know, you, you see the... And right now, you know, in the middle of your screen, number seven there for, um, that's Benjamin DeVault. DeVault, you know, locking things down. You got Davidson. Um, I'm not sure who else is out there. All across the blue zone, but they're not going to stay there long, you know. Yeah. Right there. That's, that's DeVault right there. Trying to lock down the Dorito side. Um, making moves. I, I want to see this guy right here. I want to see him get up the snake. I mean, there's nothing really stopping him. There's, it's five, what, five on three right now. They got to recognize that and make the advantage. See the lane he has right there? DeVault has a great lane to that Dorito. Oh, it looks like he clipped him, actually. Um, there's the move to the snake there I was talking right about. There. Get up in the game. Uh, this is what I want to see. I mean, I like this, though. They're taking their time. They know they got to win the point. Yeah. They don't want to get crazy, because how many times this weekend, Fish, have, oh, losing many DeVault. Times, how many times have we seen it where these guys just run on the field and get blown to pieces? Too many times. Too many times. You know, right, right there, getting in the snake, that's number 12, um, uh, Brian oh, Arakawa. Oh. He plays both sides of the field really well. You know, Brian Davidson getting the mix. Going to work on the Dorito side. He's up in the, he is in their yellow zone. <laughs> he's in their we, fridge we, we right call, now. We call that orange, the orange zone. The orange zone. <laughs> he's, in, he's in their fridge right now. He is in their fridge. He, he's actually grabbing a sandwich. Yeah. Oh, oh, but he gets clipped out. And he gets caught by the guard dog. Nice. Look at that. That was oh. a good move. Was that? That was your boy right there. Not a happy, tr you know, camper Nick, right now. Nick is having a rough weekend. Um, you know, like I said, if I want to see a replay in that dive later when we come back because you can see how uncomfortable he feels diving on that arm. And it's, it's a bummer. It's three on three on two right now, but like we talked about, coming running down the field, a great shot right there by Brian Arakawa just sitting. He's sitting chilling. there just chilling. A thorn, he, that's all nothing, he's doing right now. You know, and Brian Davidson, he's gonna, he, this is how Brian got smoked last time. <laughs> You know, let's let's kind of some kind of see what happens. Yeah, definitely. And see, Kobe, if this is Kobe Jarrett, he wouldn't be laying on his stomach like that. He'd be up in the mix, standing behind that can, knowing very well what his shots were. Definitely um, did his homework, you know. Yeah, he did. Looks like we have a three on two here. Yeah, three on two. You got um, Brian Davidson right there, just to the top right of your screen, and that is Brian Arakawa to the left. See, now he's getting a little more comfortable in there to where he knows he can do. Now across the field on your right-hand side of your screen, you see that 50 Dorito in the red zone. That is also occupied by a Liberty player right now. There he is right there. Now he's in a good spot too. They're, they're communicating the really well. Zone. Now see if he if he has a really good cross field shot. Uh, if if Brian out by that stand up. Yeah, if Arakawa decides he wants to move up, he's he's probably gonna take a couple balls, but the window is very small. Now look at look at Brian Davidson. See, he can't really see him because those pins right there block it. Now Kobe Jarrett, what he does is stands over and shoots over top of that yellow pin. Looks like they're just locking it down, just comfortable eating up. Yeah, you know what they're eating the they're eating the time up right now. It's it's a two to one game. And like I said, this is a finals game right here. Yeah, this is definitely a finals game. No one wants to give make that mistake, who's, you know? Who's gonna make a mistake? Nice move right there across the field by Liberty, moving into the yellow zone of Tennessee. Now he has a good shot. Now if 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 Arakawa is oh, going to look out the back, see, he knows this shot. Oh, see, oh, God. that's going to be a penalty. That's going to be a, yeah, major, a major penalty, penalty. on Brian Arakawa, and oh. that, that's going to cost them this game. 
That is going to cost them this game. And look at Brian Davidson. Knowing how much time. No, look, he just ran through yeah. the net. Did you see that? <laughs> he is a ninja. <laughs> saving saving the time on the clock on that penalty. That, That's key. Good, great heads up play yeah. by Brian Davidson. 22 years old from Long Island, New York. Lives in, uh, lives in Forest, Virginia. Been playing for 11 years. And that showed right there his level of experience. Um, you know, he's an he's electrical engineer, so he's obviously not dumb. Uh, he knows what he's doing. He's a great paintball player. Uh, major penalty, which means, now the major, let me explain to you guys at home. A major penalty means that point, that they'll get the point, and Tennessee is going to start with four players, and he doesn't come out. So it is gonna, he's going to be sitting in that box for a long time, and you cannot do that against a team Almost like, like the Liberty. the rest of the time. Yeah, you cannot do that with a team like Liberty, because I tell you right now, they are going to take it and run it down your throat. I mean, I, I like what I'm seeing. They're playing a heck of a lot better than they were earlier. But I think I got my girl Laura down there on the field right now. Let's take it on to her. Well, I'm wearing this new lovely mask that is a combination of new and old. And I just, it's so comfortable, I have to keep it on. Uh, great job here with this gear. I love it. So I do want to say, though, Liberty, uh, Nick Tossi struggling a little bit today, as you guys have said. And Chris Tregarthen, who's also injured from Cal State Long Beach, just pulled him aside and said, hey, man, be the aggressor. Get out there. Redeem yourself for moves that you're not happy with. These guys have a cool relationship. They actually Skype on a regular basis. They're good friends. So it's good to see Liberty and Cal State Long Beach with some of that camaraderie. We'll see what happens if somehow we ended up with a Liberty Cal State Long Beach matchup in the championship game. It would be interesting to see how Chris Tregarthen and Nick Tossi reacted to each other. Guys. Thanks a lot, Laura. And you're absolutely right. A lot of these guys are friends on and off the field. I mean, I'm not friends with anybody on the field. I, are you covering your up your roots with that mask? I mean, I, you don't want me to give you a hard time about it, I'm sure. But he anyway, says, you know, yeah, yeah. We, we, <laughs> You know, I, I think I think that Liberty is going to come out real hard, very aggressive play. But I've seen this happen in the past, Kevin, is they take up too much ground. They should concentrate and get 1G on the break. So it's a three on five. Look at the breakout. I want to see, I can see what Tennessee does. All the way to the All snake of the, the break. And take it and one take on the Billy Wing Oh, another Weiser. major penalty. The Billy Wing okay. Weiser. That's another major penalty. Oh, Nick now, uh, making moves. It's a major, uh, you know, actually, he got shot almost in the face. That was Kobe Jarrett getting shot in the face. Continues running. Now, in my personal opinion, I oh, would, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if that's a major penalty or not. Yeah, I don't think it was a major Honestly, because he always, I think he all reacted on that one. All he was doing, oh, here comes your chaos right here, Chris. You know, Payne. look at no. these guys. Heads up paintball. You know, Nick Tossi finally staying alive for a game. You know, that, that pep talk Chris gave him must have worked. Yeah, I'm telling you. You know, finally staying alive, Nick Tossi. You know, but I, I got to go back to that penalty, man. That was Kobe Jarrett running the snake. He caught a ball in the face, and he just he continued running. He was running off the field. It's not like he was running to his spot. He didn't pull his gun up. He didn't continue to play. But for some reason, in, in the judge's mind, he was playing on. Um, that's a questionable call, in my opinion. Um, but I'm, you know what? I'm not down there, so I can't actually say one way or the other. I'm just saying what I see up here. Um, nice play right there. Uh, by Cody Leeworthy. Yeah, if um, that, and if that penalty stands, it's, it's all, it's, you know, that's it. Yeah, I mean, that, that, that'll be curtains. That's curtains. They're, they're playing son. Curtains. That's three. That'll be a three-on-five situation. It's uh, it's was it three to two now yeah. in favor of Liberty, um, and it's hard enough playing five-on-five five against a team like this. Tossy right there. That's my boy. Toss point Look out. At Chris giving them some words of wisdom yeah, right there. Something, you know, Chris. Uh, Chris Trigo then saying, "Look, man, stay alive, dude. <laughs> Don't suck. <laughs> you know, and if." You know, but like I said, you know, that one penalty actually is, is going gonna, is gonna to put a hurting on those boys. So, you know, I, I guess at the end of the day, that's the ref right there on your left-hand side that called it. He's a very... He's explaining it right now. Well, you see what you happened. Know, what happened was... Let, yeah. <laughs> Let's take a look at this right here. This is a feasting. See, when you see all these jerseys, look at these guys. The they open. all want blood. In the open. Look at They want blood. See, Nick Tossi finally going down the field. Look at that stance. He, he stands like he's on a horse. <laughs> Bow legged and all. Here it comes. See? And they see Brian Davidson is nicer than I am because I would have put it on that cat. In his ear. It, right in the ear hole. You know, look at Tossie. He's like, can I run the flag in, please? I'm, I'm alive. Look at me. I'm alive. <laughs> Never Fine. mind. Forget Whatever. it. You do it. <laughs> My arms hurt too. I'm injured too. <laughs> oh, Nick Tossie. Kobe Jarrett right there. Now, I, and I, I honestly, I've watched this kid play all weekend. He, this kid's not a cheater. No. You know, so. Yeah, uh, that, you're right on that call. It was a question of call. He just, was, the momentum carried him, and he just, I mean, yeah, what I mean, do? and he was running off the field. It's not like yeah. he even he even gave up. So, timeout called right now by Tennessee. Trying um, to figure out what exactly is going on you here. You know, and they're they're in a situation right now that it's going to be a three 
on five situations. And that's tough, or five man. minutes. Yeah. Or close to five minutes. It's going to be pretty much the remainder of the game almost. You know, yeah. you're looking at Liberty right now. You got Trish Kriegard in there go. talking about it. You know, praying, doing a you little know, listen, prayer circle there. Since we have this timeout, man, I'm going to take a break through you. Some sponsors, Crystal Soya, Kevin Archuleta came at you. I'll be back in two minutes. My child sees this, she's gonna be like, "What the f are you doing? I'm trying to feed you, baby? Chop, please. <laughs> please." Welcome back to the National Collegiate Paintball Championships here in Lakeland, Florida. We've got a good one: Liberty against last year's national champions. Tennessee and Liberty just gathered around in their pit for a prayer. If everyone knows about this, you already know that they are a religious school and they like to put their Christianity out there. They're doing that. And the prayer was about getting quick points. They said, God, give us these quick points so that we can keep winning for you and glorifying you on national television. So, of course, coming from the Liberty pit, that was their message to each other. We'll see if uh, they can get the answer to their prayers, guys. Laura, like I said, you know, it's, it's, they're in a tough situation. Tennessee's in a tough, tough situation. Maybe we should go hang up that chime for them that <laughs> Maryland had. Um, you know, unfortunately, it's a three on five. I can see um, Liberty just coming out real strong, shooting yeah. some good lanes, maybe going up to the 50 on the break. And um, I, I just see Tennessee just got to get out there and shut, shut the lanes down. For they a need few to get seconds. out to the corners if they're going to yeah. survive. Or somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> Anywhere. You know, there's the breakout right there, all the, the way up to the 50, breakout. just like I said. You know, getting up in there, that's Lee worthy. Um, Nick, uh, here Tennessee the losing, a, pen, uh, losing a, a two point. Two five, this is not a good And here comes Brian Davidson, Tossie, getting in the mix. See, he actually dove like he like he wanted to. Yeah. Nick Tossie. Oh, gun turned oh, off on him. But he is just having a he's, rough day, man. Oh, the pain. Oh, he, that guy wore it on his head. He's having a rough day, man. <laughs> that's all I've got to say. Oh, Nick eliminating the last player. That's all I got to say. <laughs> good Lord Almighty. Help Davidson him. putting the hurt on that last ten, on one of those Tennessee players back there. Yeah, I, I, I like seeing Maybe that. Maybe get a replay of that. He just wore it all up in his grill, yeah. his ear. You know, it just, he tried to give him a new change his color. Right there. Hair. Tosh.0 oh, taking in the flag, shooting the last player alive for Tennessee. You know, and I still watch this coming down the field. Feeling the blood in the water. Look at Brian Davidson. He's going to come down and just put it on this Tennessee player. Brian Davidson coming. You know, he's like, I can taste it. I can taste it. I can taste it. He's like, coming. now smell wow. it. Smell it. Now oh. taste it. <laughs> and Kevin, Kevin just keeps running to the bar. He just kept going. <laughs> you know, but look at that. Hey, that's, that, a, that's a lot. Of, that's a lot of pain right a, there. That's a lot of pain. And I'm telling you, you know, at least he shot him in the, in the goggles. Though, yeah, not like in the ear. Definitely muffled some of the pain, but he, he yeah, definitely right there. felt it. There's a shot right there. Of Brian Davidson, like I said, electrical engineer. And he's he, the guy's really funny, too. If you go talk to him, he's really, he's really funny. I got to say so, you know, best of luck to both teams. You know, I think they're both out there trying their hardest. Unfortunately, Tennessee got the raw end of two major penalties. They're still going to be playing with three. Um, very unfortunate situation for the Tennessee yeah. volunteers. I mean, I was rooting for them. You know, I talked to one of their fathers earlier. I talked to a gentleman last year, um, super nice gentleman. Uh, they come a long way, man. Tennessee's far from here. I, I'd like to see all these teams do well, and I hate to see teams go down because of penalties. Yeah. You know, I, I think, and because, like I said, because it's a major penalty, I think they're still going to have two in the box. Kobe Jarrett, yeah, you can they're see definitely the frustration. Two in the box. He's, you can see the frustration on his face. Yeah. But listen, let it get out to your spots. And you know what I like about what Liberty's doing is they're shooting their lanes and they're getting the G on the break. So they're they're playing a two, a, a five on two, essentially. Definitely. Um, they're trying to get these quick points. Yeah, and you know, like I said, they sent they sent Lee Worthy up the middle right there last game. Um, you know, I, and I think that was a great move. Cody Lee where they going on? I think he's the one that actually got the G um, on the break right there. You got five seconds coming up. We got Aaron Thompson running out to the snake here. Nice breakout. Let's see what Tennessee does this game. Let's try and stay alive, boys. Tennessee make looking this, to make the corner. Uh, yeah, see? Get alive. Get in your bunker. Cross up and stay alive. Uh -oh. Look, Lee Worthy again coming up the middle of the field to the center 50 in the red zone. Look, Tennessee, they're, they're all alive, living it out. But here's the problem now. You're going to get Liberty. They're going to get outside on you. 
and who's, you're going to come out of the box, and where's he going to go? Yeah. Oh, oh get shot, shot by the back. Get shot in the back. <laughs> Lee Worthy like, can't believe it. No, you dude, come yeah, on. Get uh, off the field. Oh, they're losing two. It's a three on three right oh, now. Oh, no, it's a three on two now. Oh, yeah, they did get. But hey, somebody's, somebody's got to come out of the box. Yeah. Oh, soon. one's out of a box. There it is. Oh, but it's still, it's <laughs> still a two on three. Yep. Oh, no, it's a two on two. Two on two. It's a two one on one. In the box. No, it's a two on one situation oh. right now. Brian Davidson. Solo out there, and we talked about yeah. this. We talked about this. How, you know what? This is a bad situation. Now, see, what does Tennessee oh, have to do? Wow. Tennessee. Tennessee needs to shoot Davidson, which they. What is he doing? Yeah, what's he doing? <laughs> Jeez, what is going on? <laughs> what is going on here? Oh my lord. Oh, Kobe Jarrett comes out of the box. Yeah. We're Kobe five Jared. strong. Hey, now it's a ball game. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's what I like to see. See right there. Perfect example. Liberty stepping on their own. <laughs> feet. On, feet. feet. Oh yeah, my bad. <laughs> See, that didn't cla that did not classify as a, a bad word. <laughs> just just to let you know, I'm talking to God. I'm talking to you. So Kobe Jarrett right there coming out of the box with a fierce vengeance. A fierce vengeance. And furious anger. <laughs> so going to work four to three now in favor of Liberty. They really messed that up, man. They They're yeah. really, really they did. They definitely stepped on their feet, like shot, you said. Shot an our own player. Yeah, see? That's what he stepped. What is that? Is that, is that a... Dude, those, oh things, my Lord, those things are dude. weird, man. Look at, Look at this guy. Look at this nerd. <laughs> oh, God. Coos, 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 coos. 55. That's how many minutes it takes to cook proper couscous. <laughs> 55 minutes. Let's go check out this replay. Dodging bullets and uh, look at see he's like yeah I think I'm hit he's like nah I'm just gonna stroll over here he's like I you know what I'm just gonna stay in for a second he's like that he's bounce. like hey what are you he's doing like, at me he's like can I get back in and he looks at the judge he's like am I out what's up what's up yeah okay I'm out <laughs> <laughs> are you gonna help me <laughs> what get? child please can I get a child please child please <laughs> Brian Davidson you know I think he's the one that actually shot Leeworthy in the back <laughs> of the head <laughs> that's Cody Leeworthy getting up there, he's like, dude, are you serious right now? <laughs> and then they were probably like, oh, we got this, dog. Don't Tennessee, worry about it. We got this. Tennessee looking to be four, five strong or four strong here? You know, I'm sure Laura has a couple tidbits to throw in this. Let's go down to her and see what she has to say. Thanks, guys. And, yeah, you mentioned Colby Jarrett coming out there with a vengeance that time. He comes into the pit, and he said with his southern twang, this ain't over, guys. And we love to see these Tennessee guys coming down here bringing some southern into this whole tournament. And it's interesting because you just have to keep reminding yourself these two teams have seen a lot of each other because they're both in the same conference. And as we continue to say, they've played each other a lot during the regular season, guys. That's right. Look at this five, strong five play. On five. Oh, see, now this, Nick. This is what I want to see right now. Nick. Nick Tossie. just got blasted and dumped. Man, he is have, that's a rough spot to make, though. I've yeah. seen a lot of players be shot there. Look at, the, look at this right now. You have Brian Davidson chilling out, just knocking down the snake side. Up in you the 50. You got Jason, or Jackson Rudy. Kobe in, Jarrett taking the Xbox. walk. Kobe Jarrett taking the walk. Now look at this. Up in the 50 red zone on the left-hand side of your screen. Right there, you got Brian Davidson making the move outside all the way to the snake. Great move. Oh, he's, he needs to he's shoot gonna, this guy right gonna here. He's going to blow his back off. Oh, yeah, you're oh, dead. thanks for playing, oh, Jackson. Oh, yeah, have a good night. Have a good day, Jackson. Sorry, Mr. Jackson. Jackson. For real! That's what we're talking about up here. <laughs> Brian Davidson going to work in the snake. He needs to. Davidson eliminating another player back there. You know, but now there's two minutes and 32 seconds left. There's only a one point differential. Um, Tennessee has got to win this point. Now, what do you do, Kevin? If you're on your heels and you know the situation, A, you know Liberty's going to chill out, yeah. well, in theory. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, you need to win this point. Do you submit that you concede the point now and save the two minutes and come back out swinging? I, yeah, right. Yeah. Concede the point right now. At this point now, yeah. Now you this can point see the now, point. Yeah, you can see the point now. Concede the point. Thank yeah. you. Thank you for listening and you to come me. back out swinging. I mean, it's yeah. only two points right now, yeah, you know? Yeah, it's two points. There's two minutes and nine seconds left. I mean, it's not out of reach right now. So five to three in favor of Liberty. Davidson going to work. Um, you know, Kobe Jarrett getting up in the mix. You know, also... Jackson you know, was up in the, uh, you know, at the, at the Xbox. Yeah, I mean, getting up there. You sure it was Jackson? Yeah, it was Jackson. Jackson Rudy. Oh, Jackson Rudy. Yeah. Uh, I see. Yes, that's right. I mean, he's been having a phenomenal day as well. Yeah, definitely. So, I mean, I don't know, man. It's this is a good ball game. See, this is the this is what I'm talking about. This is the kind of paintball I was looking forward to seeing. Um, the the penalty, man. The penalty was so devastating to Tennessee. And I'm sure, like all you folks at home are watching, um, it's very it's disappointing to see a team go down because of penalties. I mean, I used to get penalties all the time. So. 
I definitely, you know, I want you guys to take a look at the, at the fighting action on the field right now. Watch this replay. This is Brian Davidson shooting his way into his bunker. See, he shoots, he's looking for his lanes. He's like, hey man, I can get, what is it written on his loader? Ready for the day of battle. Oh, okay, I see. The horse is mating. What? Mating, no. I can't, I, I'm trying to see what that says. The horse is mate, is mate ready? More ready? His handwriting is atrocious. That's why they email nowadays. But look at that. See? Look at that. That's five cents, ten cents, twenty cents. See? And <laughs> Being wasted. Oh, thank you. That must, that must be from the Bible, I'm assuming. So, the horse is made ready for the day of battle. Uh, um, and that's I, like I, Braveheart stuff right yeah, there. Yeah. Um, you know, I mean, I, I myself, I'm Catholic. So, I mean, like I said, I'm a big Liberty fan, man. I love those guys. I think I was almost in tears one year when they didn't make it because I was so dis disappointed. And they're such You're Catholic? You don't melt when you walk into church. <laughs> oh, you, she, I am Jeez. sure you melt. Uh, or there's a barrier that doesn't allow you to go in. The there. only thing I'm melting is Laura's heart. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm here all week. You got Brown right there. Another squad. See, it's they're up five to three right now. Two minutes. What do they do? Get out there and just get in their bunkers and lock down lanes. You get there and get in their face. <laughs> in the face. In the face. Oh, Kobe oh. Jarrett taking the walk again. Two, oh, three shit. players down. Four players oh, down. He got shot. No. Yeah, this, this is not good. This is good. This, this game Liberty. is over right there. Yeah. You know, you got again. Need, no, see, see, that see, see, smart, smart paintball by the Saving coach. Saving time. Yeah. See, now that, that is the. That is the team that is an undefeated team. Yeah. That looks like an undefeated paintball team right there. You know? Shooting good lanes, crisp moves. Keeping your composure. You know, Cody you know? Leeworth and getting up there. I mean, what more can you ask for? Aaron, Aaron Thompson just, you know, making that corner and snapping out uh, Kobe out there. You know, uh, in case you guys didn't see that, exactly, that, that was like a six or seven second game. Yeah. Out of the box, Liberty shoots Kobe Jarrett, both corner guys. So you're talking, you're down to three players, and then Two quick players after that. So in, in five second interval, you're you're down to one player. Yeah. So of course Tennessee, knowing seeing what's going on, concedes the point because they don't want to sit there and let the time run out because this time is gold to them right now. Yeah. I mean they still have a chance. It's only a three point deficit. It's not likely it gets a team like Liberty because Liberty can control the field so well. But there's still a chance for these guys from Tennessee, our defending champions, to come back. Definitely. So, you know, and, and watch this. Watch this break out by Tennessee. You can see they come out. You're, they're gonna, they, at the bottom of your screen, you're going to lose Kobe Jarrett right away. Also, on the top side of your screen, you're losing your other guy right away. So right there, that's one down, Kobe Jarrett. The other guy on the other side of the screen going down for sure. So he's walking up behind Kobe right now. Another quick two guys real quick after that. One, bah, gone. They walk out in drones. I think they were going to have I think they had a team meeting. <laughs> team meeting yeah, in the back. Team meeting the in the dead box. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but uh, like I said, on this field, you know, you got to get up in this yellow and red zone to make the field, uh, make the kills. Uh, you know, both teams are playing extremely Survive. strong right now. I mean, it's survival right now. Right there. Uh, Ezekiel Brown right there for Liberty coming out to play, playing a little paintball. I think that actually they're, they're getting some reps in for some of the players that didn't get to play earlier. I'm glad, you know, uh, equal opportunity. You know, Toss.0 is over there just kind of chilling like he has been most of the day. <laughs> Except he doesn't have to clean his goggles off this time. Maxing and relaxing. You know, but look at the breakout right now by Liberty. These guys are on fire right now. Look at this. Cole, Aaron Thompson right there. in that corner Cody again. Leeworthy. Cody oh, Leeworthy. Wow. Here he comes. Bringing the pain again. Losing another player, Tennessee, on the break. Oh, two players oh, now. You know, but oh. look, Leeworthy. I don't think Leeworthy knows he's there. Yeah, he's having gun troubles too. Yeah. Oh, he, now he's out. Oh, now he's out. Up. Look, oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> He's right there. Oh, God. I, don't think he, I don't think either of them knew they were there at no. first. And here's here's uh, Aaron, Thompson. Aaron Thompson getting the snake, going to work. Thompson you know, doing, doing some work, son. One minute. Doing some work. Yeah, this is, this, this is what's going to seal the deal right yeah. now for Liberty. This point right here. Yeah. Liberty needs to slow it down. Well, you oh, know, right there yeah. you got Brown going to work. Ezekiel, uh, Ezekiel Brown going to work, taking the flag in for Liberty. You know, getting some reps in right there. That's right, big one four. Big yeah. one four. Is that his Wait. age? Because he's a small what? guy. Is that one four? I can't. Oh, that's four ten. Four ten. Whatever. Four ten. Oh, that's Neil. Sorry, Neil Ebling. So I, I, sorry, I, I, Neil. Sorry, and Neil. My bad. My bad. Sorry to family at home too. Watching us. Yeah, I know Brown was out there. I think. Chris didn't mean to give your credit away to somebody else. Yeah, but Neil going to work. I mean, the kid. I mean, he's been going to, uh, you know. Liberty? School for a minute, yeah. Liberty, thank you, Fish. You know, let's uh, let's go down the let's check this replay out. I mean, these guys are just dominating right now. No gun, he doesn't know he's there. See, the guy at the X, he just comes out a little bit. He's just gonna stick. He's <laughs> Leeworthy is just gonna stick him right on top of the loader. Bap bap. 
A couple times. One there. Nope. No one two. He's like, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Why did that come from? No kidding. Cody Leeworthy, number 110. He's 21 years of age. Been playing for a little bit. Been playing for about eight years. Um, he's an exercise science major. Um, and, un, you know, uh, consequently enough, Brian Davidson is a player he looks up to um, going to work. So, Neil, number 410. He's from Salisbury, Maryland. Salisbury. Salisbury. He's, that, that kid's 21 years old. He looks like he's Jeez. 14. He looks like he's 14. He's been playing paintball for four years. Um, he loves fishing, small game hunting, you know, I mean, uh, pulling the kindergarten. I'm not, I don't really know. I don't, I don't really know what that is. Are we supposed to say his that major there? is, is that his <laughs> PG? He's actually, he is a in, industrial engineer. And yes, it says I am actually 21 years old. <laughs> he has, <laughs> his brothers and sisters are Dan and Rachel back home. So we're sending love to his family. I uh, hope everybody's enjoying the webcast here. NCPA Championships, Lakeland, Florida. Chris LaSoya up here with Kevin Catfish, my man. Tom Martinez and Maddie Marshall taking a break. And then my lady, Laura McKeeman down there on the field. Listening in right now to what they have to say. I can see we're going to get some tidbits from her in a minute right there on your screen. Eavesdropper. We have Aaron Thompson coming outside. Making the move for the corner right there. Aaron Thompson, left-hand side of your screen oh. for Liberty. Le and Tennessee losing Just, two players off the break right here. That's not good. No, but I mean, uh, oh, Thompson oh, taking Thompson. the walk. Oh, here comes, oh, here comes, and here comes a penalty. You see a penalty, another minor oh, penalty. Oh, minor. Kobe. Look at Kobe Jarrett in the box yeah, again. Yeah, <laughs> not happy with that call. Yeah, DeVault, yeah, not at all. Once again, Kobe going back to his little room in the back of the field and, there. Yeah, here, here comes up. Uh, here comes the pain train. I mean, you're looking at 37 train. seconds, 73 yeah. in favor of Liberty. I mean, it's right there. I mean, it's Josh Parrish. He's a he's a great paintball player too. He's 21 as well. Been playing paintball for eight years. He uh, he works at the family business um, in Newport News, Virginia. Uh, he is uh, his major is broadcasting, and you know he loves playing paintball. He'd probably not be. You know, look at this with look at this penalty real quick. I mean, right here, you're, this is Aaron Thompson getting smoked. Um, he's having a bad day. He gets smoked, and the back center guy gets smoked pretty much at the same time. <laughs> he's like, oh, did I get hit? Oh, yeah, I'm out. And then you, if you look just after that, uh, actually, Aaron's actually taking the walk right there as well. And there's Josh Parrish on the right side of your screen. He's uh, like, he's did, like, did that break? Did that? He's like, what? Did that break? That one don't Wait, count, did is it? That insurance? Is that, did, is Does that? my insurance cover no, that? No, no he's it like, I, I was like, I can't see through this paint on the yeah. top of my lens. <laughs> <laughs> your insurance doesn't cover that, son. So right there, that's Josh Parrish making the move up the middle. Haven't seen a lot from him today, you know, but the Braveheart mask. At, at the same, he's a great Now look at this penalty. As they're rewinding it, um, we're going to come back out and take a look at the penalty, I'm sure, in one second. He was definitely not too stoked about that at all. <laughs> you know, here's the penalty right now. I guarantee he's not stoked. He got clipped. I just saw it hit him, for sure. You, and now, right now, the ref's running over to him. And when you see a ref running at you, that's usually not a good thing. Yeah. But, like, he was already hit at this point. So the ref's coming across, all right, there. knows he's hitting the loader, throws the, ma throws the minor penalty, which is the right call. Yeah. Because he was hit right as soon as you came into that clip. Um, you saw him get hit in the loader. I'm sure you guys at home saw it. I saw it. Uh, you know, but unfortunately, you know, it's there's no coming back from this. You got no. 33 seconds. Eight Liberty to three. has a commanding 8-3 lead. I mean, five five points in 33 seconds. That's right. You know, this game against Liberty and against Tennessee did not go the way I mean Tennessee expected it to. Those two major penalties definitely put a hurting on them. Um, coming up next, UConn taking on University of Omaha, Nebraska, Nebraska. better known as Vicious. Those guys are playing real well. I'm looking forward to seeing somebody, you know, give them a game right now. You know, look, I'm, I'm, Tennessee's going to come out firing. They're going to want some blood. So look for look for number uh, 13 right there going to work. I'm not sure exactly. Sorry, I'm not sure what his name is exactly. But up the middle, all the way up the middle, going to go all the way through. Watch. All, see, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, double X's. Aaron Thompson, double A in it. Look at this. Get yeah. up in there. Get in the mix. You know, hey, now oh, see this. three Tennessee players coming off. This is what I like to see, though. Have some heart. Get yeah. out, get on the field. Go out there, and you know, if you're not going to win, put a hurting on somebody. Aaron, grab the flag, bro. Aaron, grab the flag. Aaron, everybody, everybody's yeah, dead. Aaron. Over. Aaron, grab the flag, please. It's game over. Here we go. Oh, oh God! If he'd have fell, three, I would have. If he would, if he would have fallen, I would have literally fell out of my chair laughing. Awesome game right there. That's Josh Parrish, number 44 for Liberty. Final score of this game is going to be 9-3 to three in favor of Liberty. Now, like I said before, hot or cold, who's coming out? Liberty yeah. Flames come out. Uh, flaming. <laughs> flaming hot. <laughs> flaming hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's <laughs> hot. No, but like they come out, they play hot or cold. Tossi having a horrible day. So I'm not going to talk about him right now, unfortunately. <laughs> Uh, Dude, even with, with him having a horrible day, the rest of the team stepped up. Yeah, you know what I mean, they Brian stepped up David, the plate. Brian Davidson, uh, Cody Leeworthy, uh, Neil Ebling, uh, everybody, Ezekiel Brown, Josh Parrish, 
Uh, they all had a great game. So, like Brady I said, was stunning today, though. Yeah, deep roster, all playing really well. Um, and that's like I said, that is the team that is an undefeated season team. Yeah. So that's the team I was expecting to see. And there's my boy Tossi right there on the left-hand side of your screen. You know, not very happy, having a bad day. Walking next to Aaron Thompson right there, Brian Davidson, all the teams. See, much love by all the teams. Um, I, I tell you, these are two of my favorite teams uh, on 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 the board right now. Yeah. Here, Fish. So definitely. You know, Tennessee, unfortunately, our league national defending champions unable to come through against Liberty right now. Nine to three, our final score. Um, but let's let's see how it all pans out at the end of the day. I mean, now look look what's going to happen here. These guys are going to get together. They're going to have a prayer. Um, they do this all the time. And this is one thing I love about these guys. They sit down. They look at this. They're all having a prayer right now. I wish I wish you guys could hear it. Um, but I, I, this is what I love. This is why I love these college championships tournaments. I come here because of this. Uh, this Tennessee team and all that they do, Lord, uh, just soften their hearts and let them know that, that they are loved and uh, win, win, lose, or draw. Yeah, I can't hear anything. Uh, so, like I said, you know, they're they hard, hard players and they are tremendous athletes. And God, I respect them so much. I'm so thankful for their gameplay and for their honesty. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 Yeah, yeah. Hey, good game, fellas. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and like I'm telling you, you know, see, that's what I'm talking about. That's why I love these two teams. I mean, they did this last year. I mean, you don't get this on my side of the sport, like in the pro things. I mean, you have your friends here and there, but these guys actually really love each other. I mean, you know, and I'm sure that I think my girl Laura's downstairs right now with Brian Davis. Let's go down to her and see what she has to say. All right. Thanks, Chris. And yes, Brian, this is a Tennessee team that you guys have seen a lot of, and you've beat them by a lot this yeah. entire season. But the difference today, they knew this course, and they were giving you guys a little more problems in the beginning. You're able to win by a decisive victory. Just talk about the entire game. Um, well, at the beginning of the match, we were having a little trouble shooting them off break. Uh, we were able to focus on that more, get our lanes down on point. Uh, we were able to get some good shots off break and uh, push, push together as a team. Uh, and we're just able to come out with a victory. This is a pretty deep team talent-wise. And I remember talking to you guys yesterday, and you said this is the best Liberty team that you've had. You think that's true? That's very true. We've been, a lot of us have been playing together for three or four years now. We have about four or five seniors. Um, so just that team chemistry, you know, we're in each other's heads. Uh, and it just helps a lot. So that's really been working for us. Strengths on both sides of the field and, and also off the field. And we saw that just now with the prayer. How does that make this whole thing that much more worth it to you and your team? Uh, it's more of just a, a ministry to us. It's to uh, honor our God. Um, it's really just, it's another way to show people our love. Um, and it, it, it brings, you know, fun, more fun to the game, I think. Um, you know, it's not as much of a, you know, like there's nothing in it besides a, we won the national, you know, championship. It's not like we're winning a ton of money or, or anything like that. It's just, it's just fun. I mean, we just love being together and it's fun. Well, we're having fun too. We yeah. appreciate it, Brian, and have a good uh, rest of your day. Chris, you're having fun up there. I know that's the case. I, I always <laughs> have fun. Thank you, Laura. And like I said, your tidbits Thank down the you. field, you know, I got to tell you, they're, they're gold up here to us right now. But I'll tell you right now, next game coming up, we have UConn taking on University of Nebraska Omaha. You guys stay put. We're going to take a short break. I'll be back to you soon.